Well, look at this. We're delighted to be joined by the hat trick hero at Villa Park, Young Min Son. Sonny, thank you so much for giving us your time and talking to us. I've got to ask you, first of all, congratulations on the hat trick. Second of all, half time. What did Antonio Conte say? Because that first half, Aston Villa had a ton of chances. Second half, you blew them away. No, I mean, uh, he spoke a lot of, a lot of tactics things, obviously. We started really well, score first goal, and afterwards uh, we struggled really. And uh, Aston Villa created so many chances, and yeah, he told us what we should do. And das Tor war nicht nicht ganz für mich. Natürlich, Conte hat super gearbeitet vorher, super gespielt, und deswegen für mich war einfach zu machen. Ja, aber werden natürlich nicht schlecht jetzt auswärts ein Tor zu machen. Der Anfang war natürlich ein bisschen sehr schwierig, weil wir waren auch sehr unsicher und die Fans waren auch natürlich unsicher. Yeah, first of all, it's really heavy. I didn't expect, <laughs> I didn't expect that was that, that heavy and uh, yeah, it feels amazing. And when I saw it first time, I, I felt like a little bit emotional because when I was a kid, uh, I was dreaming for it. And as soon as when I had it in hand, I couldn't believe it. And still, I don't believe it. Now you've been playing for Tottenham Hotspur for nearly like four years, and you are now staying in England, communicating with people in English. So, how was your like your journey in learning English language? How was your first start? <laughs> uh, yeah, when I first came to to England or London, actually I couldn't speak English well, so I had a lesson like six months. But I think the best thing to do is to speak with your friends. So. Even when you make mistakes, uh, still I make the mistake, and the, the players or the friends uh, try to teach me how to how to speak and how to spell. And I think this is this was very important to learn English. And yeah, right now my English is not not so good for me, and still a lot of to to lot of to to do improve. But yeah, I think the the friends and the players uh, helped me help me a lot and to speak better English than before. Now you are speaking English quite confidently. Did you have any ways, or were there any tips for you know building up your confidence uh, for English? You know, I'm a, I'm of the type who always trying something. You know, even when I say I, I said before already, when I make a mistake, I try to keep saying the same things. And uh, uh, you know, when of course you will make mistake because it's not 100 percent your language. But I think it's most important you try it and then fix the problems and fix the mistake. I think this is most important part of my English. I don't know, some some people have a different 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 way to, to learn some, some language, but I think for me it was really, really important to try to every single single day. When I went to school, 
I learned something. I used it straight away when I came to the training and to the to the teammates. And I think this helped me a lot. I don't know if you, if it's work, but you should try to work like like this and probably will will helpful.